Uganda's Health Minister Jaina Seng visited a new Ebola treatment unit in the central town of Mubende alongside U.S. Ambassador Natalie Brown on Tuesday due to a recent explosion of cases in the country. This explosion is due to residents exhuming a contaminated body at night and undoing the work of the safe burial team in order to give the deceased a proper Islamic funeral. The population are beginning to understand that Ebola is not witchcraft, as evidenced by the fact that when they exhumed a body, the entire team that exhumed the body fell sick and uh, had to be admitted, and unfortunately we lost three of them. So I do hope that, uh, you know, there will be good progress moving forward. According to health officials, the 42-bed facility is designed to help patients recover quickly and reduce the stress of isolation. There are high-risk zones and there are what we call green zones, where the family members can come and interact with the patients with a two-meter distance in between. Obviously, they can't shake hands because the patients will be inside their rooms. Each room is self-contained with its own bathroom and toilet. Ebola has infected 130 people and killed 43 in Uganda since September 20th, when the outbreak was confirmed in Mubende days after local officials first noted a strange illness.